Let's do some over 50 hooded eyes makeup. The first thing I'm going to do is conceal the discolorations on my lid with a little bit of concealer. Then I'm going to set that with a little bit of translucent setting powder. The color I'm starting out with is called Cinnamon Roll, and that is going to go from my crease up toward my eyebrow. And then I'll blend whatever's left down onto my lid. Then I'm going to grab a darker color called July 11th. With my eyes wide open, I want this to go above the highest part so that when I look straight forward, you can actually see the color. And then I'm just going to blend this out, swooping it way far out to the side because I really want to create a nice elongated eye. Then I'm going to grab this light color. It's kind of like a cream color. It's called Glaze, and that's going to go right underneath my brow. The palette that I'm using is by Anne Nook. It's velvety soft and smooth. It's clean and PETA approved. It's got 20 shades that are both cool and warm tones. It's just a literal dream to use. Now we're going to grab some of that cinnamon roll and just go under my eye to give this a soft framed look. Back in with a little bit of July 11th. Don't worry, this is going to look amazing when we're done. And this is really where I'm creating more shape for my eye. That's basically getting tapped into the crease. I'm bringing it out a little bit to meet that bottom line. And then I'm barely, barely blending that upward. Now, so far, everything that I've used has been a warm tone, but I'm going to show you how I'm going to mix some of those cool tones here in just a minute. But first, I'm adding a little bit of gold, which is called Adorn. And then I'm going to grab some of this copper color that's called Worthy. And that's going just on my movable lid. Putting it there for my eye shape is actually going to make that movable lid look a little bigger. Now, I've been dying to get into this color called Gleam, which is a silver. Oh my gosh, it is eye-poppingly gorgeous. These colors are super pigmented, so a little bit goes a long way. Just tapping it right there. Then I'm going to give my arch a little lift by putting a little bit right there. And that's it. We're done. I literally cannot say enough wonderful things about this eye palette. 